Hi guys, I just wanted to talk to you today about Yerba Mate. So this is the mate that I sell. As you can see, it's a herbal tea. Uh, I've been recommending it to people for hangovers and not just hangovers from alcohol. People have experienced similar um, symptoms to hangovers just from taking ordinary medications. And I've been telling people that the Yerba Mate can actually offset hangovers, offset these um, side effects of the drugs that people are given that make them feel hungover, again, offset side effects of antidepressants and things like that. It's called the friendship tea in South America because you drink it with your friends and you feel happy. It's got uh, theobromins in it, which are very similar to the, the substances that are in chocolates that just make you feel good. And it's full of antioxidants. I know that out there with hangovers, there's a, a trend at the moment, uh, especially amongst the corporate community, to get the drip for hangovers. Now, the drip for hangovers, I don't know if people realise that the drip for hangovers is just fluids. Right? It's usually a saline solution. And what the fluid does is it sits you still in a chair for an hour while you're having the drip. And sitting still for an hour when you've got a hangover and taking fluids in is going to make you feel better especially if you've been vomiting or if you've got diarrhea but if you have got a hangover that's not that bad well you know that the drips they don't you know the people that do the hangover clinics they tend to put other things in their drips and what they're actually trying to copy with the things that they put in their drips is what's naturally in mate tea because it's got over 250 vitamins and minerals in there. It's chock-a-block with vitamin C and vitamin B, right? And and then it's got all your antioxidants as well. Like it's um, got collagenic acid. It's got no catechins. It, it's like green tea, but just so much better. So what I'm trying to say to you is if you are feeling hungover and you can get hungover feelings from herbs so yes your um our, our monthly cycle for women the 60 day cycle for guys if you're feeling a bit cranky this is the best thing it is just a feel good tea it is very very good for you it's very youthening it makes you feel wonderful right? especially if you're not feeling wonderful at the moment i really believe that everybody should have yerba mate in their cupboard a packet this size Right, you just uh, put it in your tea doucher and put it in uh, South America. They just put it in the bottom of the cup and then they have a, a hot, well, it's a metal filter straw that they drink it through. But it, I, that burns my lips. I'd rather put it in the tea infuser and put it in your cup. But there's 10 very generous servings in there. You could actually make 10 pots of tea that you serve with your friends and probably about 20 cups. So I think you should keep some of this in the cupboard if you tend to be somebody that wakes up in the morning not feeling good. You can get a hangover from too many sugars the night before. Right? You don't have to have alcohol. So if you're one of these people that's been waking up bad and you don't know why you're waking up bad, having trouble waking up, that's where the yerba mate comes in. And remember, all you corporate guys, Keep it in your cupboard at work because you can't always dash off to have your drips. And your drips, they're just trying to replicate what's in the Yerba Mate anyway. So my love, I just thought I'd mention that because I had a lady yesterday saying that she was waking up not feeling good in the morning. Yes, she was a bit of a sugar binger and she was going to go and start having those drips regularly. Oh, that horrified me. So it made me realise I should get out the Yerba Mate, tell everybody about it and let you know what's going on if you want some yerba mate and you can't get it you're welcome to write to me i get the best quality organic one straight from south america or fair trade so and mine's just five dollars so i just move that in closer so you can see it there it's just five dollars for that bag and as you can see that bag's quite big anyway my loves that's my little saturday morning live session for you looking after your health yet again yeah looking after your health internally not just with the walks and the exercises and the sun gazing but sometimes we need a little help from our plant brothers and sisters and yerba mate is certainly a herb that was made to go with humanity 
So I hope you've enjoyed me sharing that information with you this morning. I'm going to try and do some regular herbal updates for you because um, people who have done my healing workshops with me love my information about herbs. So I will keep you updated with things and every now and again we'll pop in and have a little chat about herbs. Please, in the comments below, if you want to share, if you've used um, yerba mate in the past, you've had some success with it, or you've not had success with it, make a comment. Um, tell us, if you haven't had success, how you've administered to yourself, and we will discuss as a group how you can best do uh, the administering of yerba mate to yourself, so it will actually work for you. All right, my darling. Every blessing to all of you. I wish you joy. I wish you health. I wish you happiness. All right. And have a great Saturday.